Assalamu alaikum friends welcome to my youtube channel in this video we are going to show you that how you can apply a thermal compound or thermal paste onto the cpu of your notebook laptop and the desktop pc so there are four screws and each one of them is labeled with the numbers 1 2 3 to 4 and you have to open them each of the screws diagonally such as you first you will open the 1 and 3 and then 4 and 2 so we are just unscrewing this after uh, unscrewing uh, you will be able to pull it out the thermal uh, heat sink so you have to make sure that everything is unscrewed and you have to also unscrew the screws at the bottom and here is the clip that you must also unplug it carefully so here we have unplugged this conductor pin and it's made of plastic so you must take it out and pull it out carefully as you can see here we are having a cooling fan which is basically used for cooling purpose of your CPU so we will just pull it out and as you can see there is a uh, it is the component is very dusty including the heat sink and the whole board or the motherboard is also covered with a mesh of dust so we will just clean it out and pull it out all the dust and clean it well before applying a new thermal compound so here we have to pull out the the heat sink and we are finally done with it and here we have the face of our CPU it's actually a coated CPU which is powered by Dell and we have to uh, rub and clean and brush all the motherboard and the CPU side and the suction side very carefully and uh, clean all the thermal compound which is uh, pasted on the CPU so we will also clean the heat sink and remove all the uh, old residue of the thermal compound on the thermal heat sink you may use a good quality cloth or a soft cloth or a cotton cloth to remove all the old thermal compound and we will just apply all the thermal compound over the surface of the CPU and after applying uh, we would be able to uh, land our uh, heat sink into the notebook and you have to do this all the work carefully as you can see in this video But during this, make sure that you are not damaging any of the electronic component on the motherboard. And now you would same and repeatedly, diagonally screw and screw all the bolts uh, over the CPU heatsink. And after that, uh, you would be able to. Uh, pick your cooling fan and put it on the notebook so here is our final step and in this step you will just uh, make sure that all of the components are screwed inside your notebook and nothing is missing even a uh, uh, strip of a thermal wire or a conducting wire because there are a number of pins that gets pulled it off when we are not uh, working on the electronic equipment and without any precaution so you have to 
be really careful about this and uh, must take the precautionary measures before doing this technical work so i hope that you would have enjoyed our video and it was uh, a simple tutorial to which you would were able to uh, simply apply the thermal compound please like and share and subscribe